first priority left hand side 119 divided by 7 what is the 119 divided by 7 17 or minus 17 becomes plus 17 53 plus 17 70 how many times 210 3 times or next question number 47 first priority left hand side 390 and 260 what is the difference 130 next uh, 8 square minus 9 square that will be 64 and 81 or what is the difference 17 negative 17 becomes positive 17 what is the answer 147 next question number 48 right hand side 2 power something means left hand side also converted to 2 power something 4 power 4 means it is 256 16 for the 64 how many times 4 times or not then left hand side we return 2 square into 2 square that will be 2 power 4 that is equal to 2 power 6 minus something or not then something must be 2 or not next question number 49 <coughs> first priority bracket in denominator or not 4 5 how much 20 almost 6 times 6 plus 11 17 next question number 50 uh, 3 by 5 of 2 by 9 of 945 5 9 the how much 45 45 2 times again 1 time or not 3 into 2 6 uh, into 21 126 minus 1 125 that is 5 cube or next question number 51 uh, first 30 percent of 60 percent of 300 numerator 4 4 zeros denominator also 4 zeros are cancelled 3 into 6 18 into 3 means 54 100 plus 54 what the answer 154 next question number 52 what the right hand side value 36 square left hand side 28 square means we return a plus b into a minus b 36 plus 28 into 36 minus 28 what is the 36 plus 28? 64 into 8. 64 which one cube? 4 cube. 8. 2 cube or not? Then answer 4 into 2. 8 or not? Next question number 53. First priority 13.2. Uh, these two are adding or subtracting? Adding. Total it is 45. 100 minus 45. 55. Next question number 54. Cube root of 729. 9. How many times? 9 times. 9 plus 72. 81. Which one square? Next question number 55. First of all, what is the right hand side value? 14 square. How much? 196. 7 square? 49. 6 square? 5 square? 25. 36 plus 25. 61 plus 49. 110. Difference 86. Next question number 56. Comparison of quantities. Quantity 1. Inlet A fills an empty tank in how many hours? 24 hours. And inlet B fills the same tank in 36 hours. Outlet C empty the tank in 60 hours. What is the LCM of 24, 36 and 60? 300. 60 or not? What is LCM? 360 or not? First one, 24 means how many times? 15 times. Second one, 10 times. Third one, 6 times. Then third one efficiency, negative 6 or positive 6? Negative 6. What is the quantity one? Time taken by A to fill 3 eighth of the tank when inlet B is closed and outlet C is open. Means only A and C or only A and B? A and C. What is the A efficiency? 15. C efficiency? 6. Difference? 9. But we required 3 by 8 of the tank or total tank? 3 by 8. Then we return 3 by 8 of 360. It is filled by A and C. What is the A and C efficiency? 9. 9 how many times? 40 times. 8 again? 5 times. What is the Q1? 15. Next quantity 2. The time taken by inlet B to fill 1 sixth of the tank only inlet A is closed, but outlet C are open or not? Means B and C are only B. B and C. One sixth tank means one sixth of 360 or not? It is filled by B and C are only B. B and C. What is the B and C efficiency? 4. 4 how many times? 90. 90 by 6 means 
15 are run, then q1 equal to q2. Which option? Fifth option. Next question number 57. x square minus 17 x plus 72 means x roots are 8 comma 9. y square minus 20 y plus 99. y roots are 11 comma 9 are 8 compared to 11 comma 9 less than 9 compared to 11 less than 9 compared to 9 equal what is the answer q1 less than or equal to q2 Next question number 58 a sum of 1400 is invested for how many years 2 years in a scheme offering compound in the compounded annually at 20 percent per annum what is the quantity one the interest received from the given scheme at the end of the 2 years 2 years interest means that is compound interest or simple interest Compound interest. 20% for 2 years, what is the compound interest? 44% of which value? 1400. Okay, that is 14 into 44. 560 plus 56. Total it is 616. Q1 or Q2? Q1. Next quantity 2. Amount received when a sum of 500 is invested in the given scheme for how many years? 2 years. Second time, what is the investment value? 500. Given scheme for how many years? 2 years. Amount received or interest received? Amount received. 20% for 2 years or the compound interest 44 but amount means 144% of which one? 500. 144 into 5 it will be 720. Then answer Q1 less than Q2. Mr. 59. A says 6 years ends will be equal to the price of P's present age. A says 6 years ends means written A plus 6 are run. That is equal to 3 times of which one? B value are Means written 3B or B? 3B. What is the second one? 4 years ago, the sum of the ages of A and B was equal to twice of C present age are But C present is given how much? 39. 13 double. Sorry, C present value 13. Double means 26. The 26 equal to which one? Sum of their age, how many years ago? 4 years ago. 4 years ago, sum 26. At present, sum 26 plus 8. How much? 34. Means A plus B equal to how much? 34. What is the A plus 6 value? 3B. But A plus B value? 34. Simplify these two. We are get the B value. After that, we are get the A value. Plus A minus A cancel. This one we return 6 minus B. It is equal to 3B minus 34. What is the difference between 3B and B? It is overall 4B. 6 and 34. 40. 4B equal to 40. What is the B value? 10. If B value are 10, what is the 3B value? 30. Then A value? 24. What is the question here? A present. What is the answer? 24 years. Next question number 60. The total interest received when 300 is invested for how many years? 3 years. In scheme A, offering simple interest at the rate of R percent per annum and obtained 780 rupees invested for the same time. In scheme A, R percent per annum is 648. What is the value of R? Both the cases principal are different. But both the cases rate of percent are same. Both the cases time period also same. One case interest plus another case interest total how many rupees? 648. That is both the cases interest are only one. Both the cases. But after three years or after one year? After three years. After three years interest are 648. What is the one year interest? Divide by three or not? Divide by three means two, one, six or not? That is one year interest of both the schemes are only one scheme. Both the schemes. What is the rate of person in first one? R person. R person of which one? 300. That is first one interest. What is the second one interest? R person of which one? 780. Left hand side it is one year interest of first scheme. Second one, one year interest of second scheme. Both are adding. It is total interest. First percentage, two zeros are cancelled. And here percent, one zero get cancelled. R direct calculation. Three how many times here? 100 times. 3 and 3 how many times? 260 times. 3 how many times? 72. What is the difference between 100 R and 260 R? Sorry. Together. Together means it is 360 
or equal to 72 into which one? 100 or 360 almost 20 times or what is the R value? 20% or take the R value 10% we are get the sum interest or it will be double means we are get the 216 next question number 61 the population of village B was 2400 in which year 2003 and it is increased by 10% from 2003 to 2004 and by certain percent from 2004 to 2005 if the population of the village B was 3036 in which year 2005 what was the percentage increase in the population from 2004 to 2005 first of all what is the 2003 value 2400 next year how much percent are increased 10% what is the 10% of 2400 240 adding or subtracting adding what is the total value 2640 and it is after one year but after two years the population becomes how much 3036 okay before increased 2640 after increased 3036 how much value are increased 290 396 the 396 is calculated on which one 2640 multiplied by 100 okay and what is the 10% of 2640 264 5 percent 132 both are adding 396 then percentage 15 percent then answer fifth option 15 percent next question number 62 a can finish a piece of work in how many days? 63 days. He worked alone for how many days? 28 days. And then B replaced him. B could finish the one third of the remaining work in 10 days. In how many days B alone can finish the whole worker? First of all, what is the one day work of A alone? 1 by 63. But he worked on it for 28 days. Then 28 days work are 28 by 63. 28 by 63 means 7, 4 times 7. 9 times. How much fraction are completed? 4 by 9. What is the remaining work? 5 by 9. Remaining work is how much? 5 by 9. B could finish it one third of the work or total work? One third of the remaining work or not? What is the remaining work? 5 by 9. In that one third is completed how many days? 10 days. First we return 1, in, 1 by 3 into 5 by 9 means what is the fraction we are getting? 5 by 27. What is the meaning? Out of 27 parts, 5 parts are completed in how many days? 10 days or not? Means total work is 27 parts. In that 5 parts are complete in how many days? 10 days. But we required total work is completed in how many days or not? 5 parts are 10 days, then 27 parts are 54 days. Next question number 63. A and B together invested 9600 in a business. If B share was 3850 out of the total annual profit of 6600, what was the investment made by A? And yet there is no clarity about the time or not. Means time is constant or changing? Constant. When time is constant, investment ratio and profit ratio both are in directly proportional. Okay. First of all, what is the together profit? Together profit. 6600 in that B profit 3850 first 0 0 cancel 660 means that is 11 multiple 60 times 11 how many times 35 times again 5 how many times 12 and here 7 means total profit 12 parts in that B profit 7 parts obviously A profit 5 parts or what is the profit ratio 5 is to 7 when profits are 5 is to 7 means investments also 5 is to 7 or not? because time is constant or changed constant and total how many parts 12 parts 12 parts are given how much 9600 but required which one investment a investment how many parts we need 5 parts 12 how many times 8 times 5 into 800 4000 next question number 64 the respective ratio in the present days of A and B is how much? 9 is to 10. And present days of A and C is how much? 9 is to 11. C present days is given how much? 33. What is the B present days? Two ratios are given. Conversion into three terms are. What is the A represents how many parts? 9 parts. B represents 
10 parts, C represents 11 parts. What are the 11 parts are given? 33. Obviously, 10 parts, 30 years. What are the answer? 30 years. Next question number 65. The difference between the speed of the boat in downstream and that of upstream is given how much? 4 km per hour. Downstream speed and upstream speed difference equal to 4 km per hour. What is the downstream speed? M plus S. What is the upstream speed? M minus. Difference means 2S. 2S equal to 4. S equal to 2. And one more boat to travel 28.8 km downstream in 2 hours. 24 minutes. Speed means it is always per hour value or per minute value. Per hour. Okay. And here 2 hours how many minutes are given? 24. 2 hours 24 minutes means it is considered 144 minutes sir. In 144 minutes how much distance are covered? 28.8 sir. That is considered 0 0.2 times sir. Yes sir no. 144 double how much? 288. In 144 minutes 288 kilometers. Then 60 minutes 120. But here 28.8 means that will be 12 kilometers or 120. 12 kilometers means downstream speed equal to which one? 12 kilometer per hour. M plus S. What is the distance value? 28.8. What is the time is given? 144 minutes. Divide by 60 means multiplied by 60. 144 how many times? 0 0.2 times. Into 60 means 12. M plus S is how much? 12 kilometer per hour. What is the S value? 2. M plus S 12 means M value or 10 or What is the question here? What is the speed of the boat in still water? What is the answer? 10.